I think it's the best kept secret in town. I believe WPA TV is important to the community for a number of reasons. First, it's, it's non-commercial. Because it's non-commercial, the people who come on are talking in a very authentic way about their own lives. A local television station like WPAA gives folks the opportunity to come on and produce a show. So it gives members of the community an opportunity and an outlet to try their hand at, at production. That in and of itself is very viable. You can trust community-built TV in a way that you can't trust um, corporate-built TV because corporate TV is always about the advertising dollars. There's no, there's no corporate sponsors. There's nobody pulling the purse strings saying that you can say this and you can't say that. I can say anything I want on the air. You know, nobody has any input on what, I, what content I create. As a community resource, WPA is the hidden secret of Wallingford. I was impressed when I first came to WPA TV, which again is three and a half years ago, and I continue to be. The level of professionalism seems very high. Being a Wallingford resident, how do I not take advantage of something that one, you know, we pay for through fees through the cable company, and two, free resources like how do you not take advantage of that if you're interested in this medium it's just it's just a no-brainer and and it's a it's it's a gold mine it's it's a gem in in the city just get more people to come in and utilize some of this equipment because it's uh, state-of-the-art equipment you have an opportunity here free equipment to be borrowed taken out used come back training on how to edit which is the state of the art equipment here the fact that i can access near film quality cameras to do the job that i need them to do is an indispensable advantage so i think the potential here is i think is unlimited and now with the uh, with the internet and, and the live streaming it's you know, the sky's the limit. This is really a gem of the community that I think is being hidden a little bit. It's not just for TV. Uh, we have uh, a lot of other media resources. Uh, we have the community room downstairs that's available for anybody that needs to use it. The one thing I would say I would love people to know about WPA TV is that it's so flexible, available, great resources. People, are, my, when my guests come in, they're so impressed with the state-of-the-art studio. It gives the public a chance to voice their opinions. And it's a good chance for other people to learn, just like some of the students that I've met here, uh, learn a new career. Oh, it can be a valuable uh, resource for those residents that are interested in local programming. It belongs to everyone. Uh, one of the things that we say with our mascot, Freeman P. Quinn, uh, the free speech ambassador, is anybody can be Freeman. Anyone can be involved in free speech. Anyone can be involved in telling community stories, helping get the word out about their neighbor, uh, helping make the community better through media. Well, number one thing I think the community needs to know is that we're here and we're here for the town. I think it's, I think it's pretty outstanding that it's here in general and that it has the level of stuff that it does. If somebody uh, has uh, any urges to uh, try their hand at, at local TV, WPA is here. They have a website, they got a phone number, they're on Facebook. Um, and so if they're all curious about doing something like that, um, you know, they can get in touch with the studio and have a conversation about what the possibilities are. But getting the community more involved in knowing that this resource is available and what it could do for people with, that are creative and have ideas, you know, there's a lot of work involved in it, but the rewards is just wonderful in the end. Um, it, it would, it's, it's fun to get involved. It's, uh, I think it's work. I think it's a commitment. But... Uh, but it's just, it's just so much fun, and, and there's so much to do in town. It's also a sense of camaraderie to be proud of the community and to showcase what 
people have um, available to them here in Wallingford. You have opinions. People have stories they need to tell, whether it's immediate stories, stories from the past. You know, we have so much to offer, and I just wish that more people in the community would come in, find out about us, and use us to their, to their advantage. We need to get more people using WPAA. I, I'd like to see more local programming. It would be nice to, to have uh, more people get involved. I'd like to see more people come in and explain their likes and dislikes of life itself. Everybody has a story. And uh, until we get more people to come in and take the chance and be bold and uh, tell their life story, that's what I'd like to see happen. Where I'd love to see us go from here is to see many more citizens involved, whether it be in front of the camera, behind the camera. It's the untapped resource in Wallingford. And every once in a while, if we want to drag this old fossil out of retirement, I could, uh, I'd be happy to help out. This opportunity that the children have at the high school that they can come in and get some work experience and learn how the system works, I think is just an outstanding program.